Hey guys, James and Mark here with another mukbang. If you guys are new to our channel, please consider subscribing. Today we are on a food adventure and we're gonna be checking out a new menu item that Mark's been talking about for a few weeks now at Little Caesars. What are we getting from there? They have this thing called, I think it's called Cheesy Stuff Crazy Brand. We also picked up two large pizzas we're going to be sharing today so we have a pepperoni and cheese pizza and this is just vegetables mark was a little upset because he thought the pizzas were still five dollars but now they're five dollars and 55 cents happened to the five dollar hot and ready <laughs> each of these come with three, three pieces, pieces for was it five bucks as well no 375 okay so it just looks like a crazy bread these are much girthier this is the last time we've had Little Caesars. I don't remember, and I think you probably had it more recently than me. Is that pretty? Do I need to move anything? Kind of looks ugly. <laughs> that looks like, like it looks like a foot right in front. Let me move it back here. Yeah, there we go. Okay. All right. Well, All right. first thing first. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. Oh. Oh. I think I could just do a beer mukbang today. All right. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be bold and try to do a little cheese pull and see if it works. Oh, ooh, oh. it does. Oh. oh my gosh, it, oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh my God, that almost flung no. at my face. Not your first rodeo, but it reminds me of those, oh, sticky, those hand sticky hand things. Hands. Yeah, okay, well, sorry. Don't play with your food, guys. Okay, so let's try this. There's a good amount of cheese in here then, huh? Mm. It tastes like they're crazy bread with cheese inside. I think they should have always done this from the start. Maybe they would have been more popular <clears throat> than Pizza Hut. No, I think so. If they had, if they made their crazy bread this way. It's kind of a cute name, but what's so crazy about it to begin with? Growing up, I want to say I probably liked the crazy bread more than the pizza. Oh yeah? And then my high school actually sold the crazy bread Little Caesars um, packet <gasps> for lunch. Sometimes I would just buy myself a bag of Little Caesars crazy bread for lunch. That's it. Did they, did they have it every day? Wow, you went to a nice school. We only have Pizza Hut once a week. Pizza Hut was... Ooh, I don't... Yeah. You had both? Yeah, in the, in the personal pan pizza in the foil. I went to the wrong school. Mm. I mean, I don't mind just eating this actually. Crazy bread, like if we got regular crazy bread, is it still the same like size? This looks a little bit more full obviously because of the cheese, but. You know what I think it is? Is like each of the crazy breads are different sizes. It's kind of like a hand. You know how some finger, like your middle finger is longer than the others? Mm -hmm. That's the crazy bread packet. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we play a game? A game? Yeah, what? with the crazy bread. I, are these two the same in size? They, uh, they're starting to resemble something. <laughs> we each get one, and I guess we we see how much we can eat of it and take a bite, and in then one, in one bite. In one bite. Oh my! Are you serious? And then I guess the winner would be who has less crazy bread by the end, because that means you went further in, right? Are we doing the better end? First, Let's make it realistic and do the shorter end first. <laughs> realistic for who? Who knows? But Ooh, I haven't seen uh, this size in a while. Oh <laughs> hell no! Oh. 
Uh, just a disclaimer. I mm. I don't look like this. I just kind of um, you know, I look better than normal. <laughs> Why do you have to disclaim anything? <laughs> so who won? I mean, I feel like I declare a tie. Now, did you have any um, like tear tear droplets coming out? Cause you look a little watery eyed. <laughs> no, I'm fine, girl. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> look in my eyes. How are they? A little twinkle. You're just if, saying that. At least I don't need to wash it down with extra, like... It started getting liquid. dry. It was like the real thing. <laughs> <laughs> let's get to the pizza. <laughs> no! <laughs> huh? Yeah, let's get to the pizza. Start off with the vegetable one first. Yeah. And then, are you going to do pepperoni? I want to start out with pepperoni, yeah. Okay. It's almost like right, uh, uh, like a small step above thin crust. Not quite thin crust, but it's not the full like pan mm -mm. one at Pizza Hut either. Mm. For sure, the crazy bread or the stuffed crazy bread is better than the pizza. No, yeah. something about the dough part is a little like cardboardy. <laughs> should we do a taste test with the actual <laughs> cardboard? No, I get what you're saying. You should have never had it taste of like a cardboard though, because now I feel like I I'm mean, eating it's, moving boxes. It's not, it's not the worst pizza, but I'm like, okay, yeah, this is not like a Pizza Hut or Domino's. But the box even says dough made fresh daily at every store. You don't believe that? I wonder if they would have let us do like half half pizza. One of the reasons we got two pizzas is just for variety. I think if you create your own pizza, you can. But if you want the 555 hot and ready, you could only do um, either, I think, pepperoni or cheese. Like, oh, you know what? That deep throat game made me full already. No? I feel like I won overall. You have a lot of conditions after that game. <laughs> Complaining already. Go ahead, what? You have a clap back. I feel like I see your whole like mind like working. Nothing's being produced right now. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna probably upset a lot of people right now. Pepperoni pizza, not my favorite. Oh, let's do a deeper dive. Why? What's wrong with it? I don't know. I mean, I don't mind it because obviously I'm eating it, but if there's a choice between just cheese and pepperoni. I'm like, oh, I'm going for the cheese, which always worked out because all the kids run towards the pepperoni, right? So there, there would always be cheese for me to grab. But my parents conditioned me to get the meat one because it's worth more. <laughs> you get the one with pepperoni because it still has the same amount of cheese as the other one. Why not get the meat, which marks up the pizza just a little mm -hmm. bit? That's actually been one thing that I'm surprised by in general. Like for instance, Mark doesn't really like um, what you would consider all the meats that you could eat for breakfast. Like not a huge fan of bacon for breakfast, not a huge fan of sausage, unless it's breakfast sausage from me. Um, yeah. Ham? No. Yeah. Uh. Why is that? <laughs> Like something happened and you're not telling me. No one just doesn't like it out of nowhere. Like I like bacon and foods. Yeah. Like in mac and cheese, I love it. BLT sandwiches, I'll eat it. In a hamburger, I love it. But just straight up bacon for breakfast so you just eat it. Mm. What ends up happening is like Mark will order that and then I get to eat the meat. Oh, he'll be like, He'll wait until I order and I'll just, and you have to choose either sausage or bacon. I'll be like, oh, I don't know, bacon. Like, <laughs> and he'll always order the other one because he knows he'll get to enjoy both choices. Oh yeah. Same with, um, they always give you guys like an option for like hash brown or mm. uh, fruit. And I get mad when he picks fruit. <laughs> fruit? I don't want fruit, but it's probably better for your health, right? I forgot to grab ranch. Sometimes I just love eating pizza and ranch. Or do we need like 
nuclear sauce or something. Mm, I think that might be good. We have the carbo one. Oh, do I try it's carbo? Just like jazz things up. I feel like you're like kind of like <laughs> kind of over this. <laughs> over it. Like you're just like ready to like next. So we have our leftover carbo sauce. Oh. You need to refrigerate this after you open it. But you know what I noticed? Hmm. After we tried reusing this um, from the fridge, it's not as spicy. It doesn't pour out nicely like oh, the other I ones. See. It mm. coagulates. Mm. <clears throat> coagulated. I, oh. Will it even come out? We'll see. So you want it on this one? Yeah, I want it on this one. Oh, oh yeah, there. Go. But it's not like flowy like the other ones, you know. And then, do you want some mayo on it? Sure. I mean, might as well. That will make it less spicy, right? This is starting to turn into like a Korean pizza. We went from Little Caesars to Little K Town. <laughs> Where's the kimchi? Bring out. Did you bring a kimchi? <laughs> kimchi topping. My goodness. Give Little Caesars a glow up. I have an idea. We glow up like affordable fast food foods. Or we just eat really good, not affordable food. <laughs> you can't handle the size. No comment? I, well, it's because I haven't had much practice with that size. <laughs> you are you are balling the volleyball at me so I could just spike it. And that sauce is always good. Um, I haven't eaten that sauce with something I didn't like yet. In general, not even just the carbo, but the other sauces too. Mm -hmm. All right, so it seems like final verdict. Get get the crazy cheesy bread. Yeah. Maybe maybe give the side eye to the pizza though. I'm mean, eating the pepperoni just because I know you don't like it. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna grab them from you. So. Did you ever eat pizza where you like just took off? The no. No. I don't think so until today for me. Mmm. Um. Because it, it doesn't have the, I think it's the, it's the, the dough. Oh, it's, yeah, you know, because I No was, to the dough. Because I was going to say the topping and the filling is not bad. It's good. It's yeah. the dough that's dough. giving me some dough problems. <laughs> say no to dough. What, dough problems? Like, that was a stretch. No, like. I want you to explain it. You're turning red. No, what's that one song like? More money, more problems. Like, yeah, no money, no problems. <laughs> no, that is so bad. <laughs> Where did these dad jokes come from? Honestly, they just started overnight. He had a sense of humor. I mean, he still does. Don't come for me, guys, in the comments. But your sense of humor has like turned a sharp, sharp right turn. It used to be very like witty and like clever, and now it's just like so outrageously like, huh? that it's funny. One could say that that's even better than witty and clever jokes. Who is this one person that says that? <laughs> <laughs> you, you're the one. Why are they even dad, they're not dad jokes. Do money, do problems. Like, what? <laughs> uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment, Subscribe and also check out one of our other videos that are now on the screen. And, and let us know if you actually had the stuffed crazy bread. Leave a comment below and let us know what you thought of it. Bye.